Hey guys, Steven here, CTO of Crypto Universe, and today I'll guide you through all the different LED colors on your miner and how they help you troubleshooting on what's going on with your miner. First of all, there are LEDs on your miner itself and on the little adapter, which is called the AUC3 adapter. So first of all, let's have a closer look at what the colors on the AUC3 adapter mean. So on your AUC3 adapter, there are three states indicated by three different colors. There is blue, which means initializing or idle normally. Then there is green, which means communication working, so that the AUC3 adapter communicates with the miner. And then there is red, which means communication stopped working for a short time, or actually means rejected share. So this is nothing bad at all, but if this happens all the time or it lights up constantly red, then there is something wrong with your AUC3 adapter or with your miner or cable. On your miner itself, you will find different LEDs. There is one status LED on the top, which indicates what your miner is currently doing. So there is a white, which means that the power is on. Then there is a blue, which means that the miner is working normally. Usually then also your AUC3 adapter should light up in green. Then there is yellow, which means that the miner does not do any work, so it's an idle. Then there is green, only for a short time usually, it means detect cooling fan and MCU board. And then there is a white or constant blinking white, that means that you have to turn on the LED manually, so you can find it in another video where we do troubleshooting. And then there is a red, which could mean a lot, so it could mean too hot, voltage um, error, temperature error, but you will find more down below in the description where we'll have an overview over all the different error codes. But then there are also some more LEDs on your miner, so on your PMU boards, which stands for power management unit, you will find these LEDs next to the power connectors and they basically indicate on what's going on with your voltage supply. So if the voltage is good, if the power supply is good, they should actually light up in green. And if they light up in red, then there is something wrong with your power supply. So the first thing you should check are your connectors and your power supply. If there is no LED light at all, then it usually means that the PMU unit is broken. 